Well, shit, I made slash, slash, really, slash missed the deadline. How do you make slash miss it? I made the video, had it ready, was about to create it, and I realized half the audio was fucked. I was like, what? So I had to reshoot, so bear with me. We'll, we'll tear this up and we'll have fun. Uh, at least I have the luck of having, well, this is also done in chapters, so you can go back pretty easily. But I have the luck of PlayStation Plus, which saves your files on, on the cloud. So I can just download my last file, where our last video ended, from Takashi Kenjo, Superstar. Dear my friend, not my dear friend. I'm really looking forward to meeting you. Bells are sure to ring in fanfare at that glorious moment. Please give the girl my regards if you see her. She's bound to be late. She's always been that way. But she isn't a bad girl. I'm sure she'll like you. Please don't stop her. She's trying to enter into a brand new world, so I want to save her. Please give me your support. I was vague as fuck. Uh, yeah, we leave now. Yep. Get out. Get out. Get the fuck out! Uh, yeah, here. That's good, because the, the last video I made, I, I waited way too long. I recorded it at like 7 in the morning. I was fucking yawning like 500,000 times. I'm trying not to do it, but I can't control yawns, man. Like I said, when you commentate, you forget <laughs> you forget to breathe right, and then yawns are a way of your mind going, Get your air back in your lungs, fucker! Same day. Kiefer Sutherland. Huh? 840. Alright. Why do you do that so slow? What target audience are you aiming for? Is this hiding a load screen? Nope, it's not. I think it is, because I'm holding X and it doesn't do anything. Waka waka. Oh wait, is there anyone else besides this dickhead? Fucking always making me do his work. Is there anywhere to go? What's in here? Hey, oh, there's no further back, okay. Go back out. I don't want to talk to you. I want to see if there's anything else I can do besides talk to you. Fucking dickhead. See, now that I know that there's actions that can fucking only happen, you basically just have to hit triangle fucking everywhere. Man! Because if there's like an inanimate object, it doesn't appear because you, you can't talk to it. You can interact with it, but you can't talk to it, so I guess it doesn't show up like this. It's a weird, weird system. How about it? I've done okay with the gathering. Yeah, I'm sure you did nothing. Shut the fuck up. That boy have anything to go on? You don't need to rush it. Take your time. Something will pop up eventually. Is that what you tell your wife? Chizuru. Well, women are complicated. Oh, shut the fuck up. Us men can't really understand them. There's a program. It's called No Ma'am. Uh, a really specific origi <laughs> original one. Chizuru is especially complicated. She's half-acidly sticking her nose into the forensic investigation. She's... So she's being... Pressured by all these unspecific personalities. Protecting her own self-consciousness is all she can do. Her job is to take other people's consciousnesses, you know? So basically, she's the ultimate nutcase. So basically, she's like the mediums on Mount Osor. I don't know what the fuck that is. It's a really tough job. It'll get better once the storm blows over. Uh, she just needs to be left alone for a bit. Shh. She's not a little kid anymore. Once she remembers that she's a professional cop, she'll be back once she remembers. Jesus Christ. Anyway, Yato, you best solidify your position here, which is while Chizuru's out. Why don't you do something, you fucking dickhead? Slash looking wanna be motherfuck. Let's go. Hey Yato, we're gonna go check around the complex. See if we can get any info from the locals. Yeah, we. I'm sure it's a we thing. It isn't glamorous work, but this is important too. Really? The re results from our questioning have already disappeared from backup? What? That's in the past. Leave your stupid comments in your pocket. I've got my way of doing things. Let's go. 
He is just an asshole, isn't he? This isn't the way out. Oh no. Oh, here it is. Waka waka. Why am I turning this into the Muppet Baby? Waka waka. Alright. What the hell? I don't even remember where we are because I've kind of done this, but I was kind of tired, so I really didn't understand. I didn't understand it at all. I remember it was a fucked up scene. Man, I'm not gonna spoil it. We're just gonna go as is, and I'm not. I'm just gonna do the best I can. Sorry, Ayato. Did he fucking fart in the car? I hate that shit. You can't escape. It's always when you have to do it. When you're fucking trapped with somebody, and you're like, fuck, I'm, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Gotta take a quick piss. Oh, don't tell me your life story. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Damn fine. How the fuck did she look that long? Jesus Christ. What? Wha <laughs> Yano, move out. That's Chizuru. Why doesn't she look like that in the main gameplay? God damn. Oh, because she's off duty. That is true. I do. I know a lot of women like that. They look beautiful in uniform at work and then out of work. It's like, oh my god. <laughs> Drop dead. Gorgeous. Huh? I wonder if this could be done on like a PS2 or if it would explode. I bet it would explode. You there, stop the vehicle! I mean, it's only a graphic novel. I'm not shitting on it, I'm just saying. I wonder like how much hidden shit is here. Like you'd think it could fit on a PS2, but I bet you it would make a PS2 explode. Because there's so many hidden techniques and shit going on. Hey, Otto's driving? What the fuck does that mean? Heh, <laughs> he's pretty good. Oh. It sounds like you're inside her head and you just hear... <laughs> just wind. So, what do you want? I'm off duty right now. I'm just a civilian. What is this? Desperate di driving? What? And you were such a good girl. Want me to make you feel better? Whatever. I told you. I have my own way of doing things. So, this definitely feels like a lover's quarrel. Is this your new partner? Good timing. By the way... Is this some kind of structural problem that the steel is cheap and the coal stretches? Cars aren't made of steel anymore. What the fuck are you talking about? Can I talk to your privates for a second? <laughs> I know that's not what it says. But that's what he is insinuating and what he wants to do. I'm fine. Why are you turning me down in front of a new kid, goddammit? I look stupid, goddammit! I'm not. In that case. Do you understand? I don't care. <laughs> this shouldn't be the time for thinking. What the hell am I watching? <laughs> well, more than anyone, you should. I like how I'm just in the alley, like, thinking in the back of my head. Where's my popcorn? Because <laughs> maybe this might turn into a porno, you know? You don't, he doesn't know. It kind of looks like it's going that way. Well, more than anyone, you should. Your father, huh? Stop it. Don't even bring that name up. Fucking thunderstorm coming? God damn it got dark out. I'm just a doll. I can't change anything. Hey Otto, can you head off to the scene on your own? Yeah, big surprise, you dickhead. Sorry, don't ask. Start questioning people thoroughly. Check every apart- It sounds like he's fucking making me delay so he can fuck her. Check every apartment. <laughs> the inner garden, too. Try going back again. The mystery is there. Don't forget to talk to people. Now get on it! What an asshole. How is that guy working here? Did he blow someone to get the job? He's not good at anything. Maybe some point he will. He sucks shit right now. He's not done a goddamn thing for me. Eh? Oh, that's right. I gotta move. Ba -dum -ba -dum -ba. Like this time, 
while we're here. Save on the fly, you idiot. Well, actually, I was saving, okay? Actually, uh, that's a lie. At the end of the last video that you never got to see because I fucked it up immensely. <coughs> um, <laughs> I forgot to save. So it actually turned out... Well, it didn't really matter, but... Shut up! At least I'm honest about my fuck-ups. I don't act like I, I first saw it and this is a lie. Alright, come on. Housekeeping! Oh, for fuck. Hi there! What's the matter, detective? You want to ask me some questions? I feel... Uh, <laughs> I don't know if I said this in my previous, or if I said it in my deleted. I feel like he is there, and like, I'm a mute. Angrily, with a notepad, writing like, angrily. And he's like, mmm. <laughs> Cause I don't think he has a voice in this game. Well, okay then, come on in. You kind of feel like you're just mute the whole time. I don't know if you are. But it's not like they gave me a picture or anything to go off of. To know he's talking. Go ahead and take your time. Honestly, I've been troubled myself. What? The landlord and management company are always bitching. I mean, this sort of thing happens no matter who works as a building manager, but still. As for me, all I know about the people living here is whatever is written in their documentation. And it's not like I had any sort of personal relationship with Haruma, so... He's like, believe me, I fucking try... That night? Yeah, I was awake. I remember hearing a sort of bang. But I never got out of my bed and stopped masturbating. That, that was cut from the original version because of... Uh, why does Japan always censor America, you know? Recently, more residents have been taking their trash out at night, and it's a hassle to warn them about it every time. So I thought that's what the sound was. At first, at least. I, <laughs> I don't think they're taking their trash out. I think he's discovered the band Stomp. <laughs> I doubt anybody even knows about what that even is anymore. They're not really a band, they're like a movement, but still. That's, that's the, uh, then when, yeah, then when I went out to clean up in the morning, I saw what had happened. Koichi. Oh, the kid on the fourth floor, right. Poor kid. The kid next door died suddenly. Hikaru, I think it was. Apparently he had a weak heart. Jesus Christ, it sounds like a fucked up joke, dude. Like, uh, like Sanford and Son, but it's a little kid. I'm coming, I'm coming for you, Easy. Oh man, that sucks. And you're a little kid, you probably don't even know what to look for at that point. I couldn't even imagine how traumatizing that would be, but people are born that way, you know? There's nothing you can do. It's just crazy that they did that. I didn't even know what happened. I guess that's why. That's why the kid's kind of talking in a really weird, overly kind of freaky tone. Not because he's, he's gay, you dumbass. Because he's he's going through the the 12 stages, I think it is, of death. Oh, my, my fucking battery died. Get out of here. Get out of here. There's no way I could ever prepare for my battery. Sounds like they were playing together, and he suddenly had a heart attack. Whatever it was, at that age, the shock must have been really bad. Yeah, that, that, that would be really rough, dude. I actually like that kid a lot more now, now that I actually know this. I didn't even get a hint of that. I didn't know what had happened. I thought he'd committed suicide for a minute. I like how uh, he very slowly leaves. They really wanted that for dramatic effect there. That's a pretty nice little touch that they tried to subtly do there. Alright, trying to set shit down without shaking the mic so you don't hear annoying bangs and clacks and... Oh, let it pass out! Uh, uh, yeah, this way. You want to throw a pillow? What is it? Are there gender Japanese people? I don't believe you. A detective? It's like, uh, what the hell is that movie? Uh, Big Troll in Little China? Is that true? Like, what is it? Uh, Asian women with green eyes are super rare. Is that true? A detective? The guy on the third floor, that was a suicide, right? See? I don't play with those kids, but I've talked to them a lot. Why would you tell a detective that? It's like you want to be investigated. 
I, I sometimes give him candy and let him take naps in my bedroom for a couple hours. You know what I mean? There's nothing wrong with that, officer. Kids do stupid things, so I tell them to be careful. When I'm working on my bike, they come right over. I told them about how the engine is built. You know, stuff like that. I doubt they understand, but anyway. They seemed really happy. My mom works nights. She's not a stripper or anything. My little brother was studying for exams. He's not a stripper or anything. <laughs> and I was out on my bike. Those are basically our alibis. A rumor on the third floor? I don't really know him. He didn't seem like a nice guy though, so fuck him. What a shock. The other kid had been really depressed, you know? I don't even know what to say to console him. Yeah, what do you say to that? It's like, hey, he's in a... Yeah, you can't say anything. There's nothing to say to that. Oh, by the way. That night I saw Haruma on the street in the front of the complex. I ride a motorcycle, you know. I didn't talk to him or anything. And the parking lot's in the back. So that's it, but... What the fuck could do that to me, you... Do you have more? Do you have more? That didn't make any goddamn sense at the end. I don't really have anything else to talk about. I wish it was more realistic. Like, you knock on the door at like 5.03, right when the show starts, and you just hear, God damn it! <laughs> Haruma, Jesus, Jasper, Japanese Casper, <laughs> Jasper. <laughs> I used to pass the building newsletter to him a lot. His apartment was kind of dark and smelled like cigarettes. He lived in the building by himself, right? You know, there was definitely something creepy about him, but to think that he killed himself. The kid on the fourth floor, right? At the Kobayashi place? How unsettling. My kid is still small, so he wasn't really at the age to be playing with the older kids. But to think what could have happened. Really, how sad. The child's mother had been really upset. The building manager, Mitsubishi, I know it says Mizuguchi, probably knows better than anyone about the residents here. We don't really interact much with the neighbors, so you should probably talk to them. This is fucking horse shit. Who are you? Uh, you just seem bitchy as hell. The police? About the other day. I don't know anything. I still picture an angry guy writing in a notepad. <laughs> <laughs> but more importantly, do something about the illegal parking out front. What, anything else? Leave me alone. I have a bad headache. About the dead guy. How should I know anything about him? I don't care, okay? Can we stop now? Alright, she's suspicious as fuck. I wish there was like a naked woman that said contact point. Shut up, Rain. Alright, come on. Stupid door contact point. What? What the? Over here. Who's this? Is this? This is no one. Yeah, I remember this. It pissed me off last time. Bitch. Okay, I went here last time, so let's... Is it gonna end if I talk to the kid? Because I went here. What? I want to go to this one. I'm gonna try this one. Still investigating? I have nothing to talk about. Haruma always came home late probably had some kind of flashy job. I never really ran into him much. I think he was at home during the day a lot. I could hear noises sometimes. But I've never seen him go anywhere. That means you never go anywhere. You jackass. It's so creepy. You're judging a guy when you're basically the same fucking thing. Because you're not going anywhere either. And you're watching him. You're creepier than the creep. You're creeping the creep. That stuff that happened next door, and the kid upstairs dying? I'm considering moving out of here soon. I mean, wouldn't you? 
kids around that age, they play around a lot, and yeah, it could be troublesome, but... If they get yelled at every time, then they have nowhere to play, right? They were building something out of a cardboard box in my space in the parking lot. You know, like you do when you're a kid. You played like that too, right? No, I made igloos. I made igloos and hid from people in fucking winter storms. I, I, it was like a massive blizzard in 93. I was the only kid outside. I made a fucking igloo and I fucking survived that blizzard. I was not like other kids. <laughs> Remembering the old days makes me feel really nostalgic. I've always been kind of isolated and a lone wolf. I didn't want to break their thing down, so for the time being, I just parked on the street. Oh. Ended up getting a ticket. <laughs> That's like the opposite of karma. He's like, oh, they worked hard on this. I'm gonna park over here. Oh, cops like, ooh. <laughs> oh, by the way, detective. I knew you were gonna say. I knew you were gonna say. Could you maybe say something to the traffic unit or someone? Tell them about my situation. Yeah, that you're such a kind-hearted creep. Shut the fuck up. It's a good enough excuse, right? No. You fucking break that. <laughs> but box and then you get the you get your house egged. That's what you do at that time. I have to answer again Both of us work so we eat every day eat out every day I took the car to pick up my wife and we ate at a family restaurant at maybe around 1030 Jesus Christ how old is this game then we went by blockbuster <laughs> Oh, I mean the video shop, you know Oh, yeah, because you're not allowed to say Blockbuster. <gasps> well, I said it. We're not advertiser-friendly. Blockbuster video, wow, what a hit. Um, and they had the third season of Millennium in the new release section, so we rented that. Oh, yeah, I have the receipt. Here, it says the time was 11.40, and I rented two videos. See? At this place, if you rent two or more new releases, you can keep them for three days, so it's a bargain. Huh? So we came back home just past midnight. So how about it? Got a good enough alibi, right? You see this kind of thing on TV and stuff. Oh, and here, we went by the convenience store too. This was 11.52. After that, the two of us just watched videos. Oh, yeah. I heard this from my wife, but... When the, de when the detectives tried to go into the apartment next door the other day, they made a big fuss about the key not fitting into the lock. You sure? You're not hard of hearing, because you're kind of far away. It could have been something didn't fit in the cock. That, that's, that's a tough one. I don't know if I can go by this... This one. <laughs> when they checked it out, someone had put a sticker over the keyhole. Wow. <laughs> Makes us feel a bit closer, doesn't it? What, that wasn't funny? Well, this is all about all I have to talk about. Good, shut the fuck up. Get the fuck out of my house. Get out of your house! Right, let's get over here. This is where we move on. I actually never got that line of dialogue from that weirdo motherfucker. Oh my god! This is the saddest looking man ever. Got him, dollar! Yes? Please! Oh, about the jumper from the other day, huh? Anything strange? Hmm. I don't think so. Oh yeah, I did hear a sound. Maybe that was the sound from when the guy jumped. I can't do that voice. Otherwise, that's about it! Oh yeah, also, just before then, it looked like Haruma had just gotten back. Yeah, I could hear his footsteps. It's pretty quiet here, so adult footsteps really reverberate. What else? I did hear the sound of a motorcycle. Okay, we already confirmed that. That was definitely the, the guy on the younger... Uh, the guy on the second floor's exhaust, I'm sure of it. But you know, that guy on the second floor... He looks kind of sketchy, but he's actually a good guy. Look into him and I'm sure you'll see. But wasn't that a suicide? What the fuck? I thought I did this. I don't know what to do. Huh? So I just go here now? Again?
What the fuck do I do from here? I thought I did this. Oh, I can go to the fourth floor now. Ooh, ooh. Let me see. There's contact points everywhere. I don't think I've been up here. Huh? Huh? The cops! What do you want? You'll never take me alive, Capas! Oh, the suicide from earlier, yeah. What a bunch of trouble. When stuff like that happens, the value drops. You're in an apartment. Shut the fuck up. Huh? The value of this place, obviously. That night I was at home. I ate dinner, watched the sports news, did some work I brought home. The economy is bad all over. I envy you guys, it's not like you have to worry about going bankrupt or anything. Now is the time to spend. Use up all the company's budget. Do whatever you want, you know? Cause trouble for everyone else and then let another department wipe your ass for you. Anything I noticed? No, nothing, really. Oh, yeah! I think it's the guy on the fifth floor, maybe. How many fucking floors are there? Yeah, I heard footsteps. Footsteps going up to the fifth floor. No, it's probably not even related, but just in case. I've never actually met the guy on the fifth floor. I mean, it was the first time I ever even got the sense that he actually lives there, you know? Oh yeah, also. This is just my own personal idea, but... I think that Haruma on the third floor got killed by Hikaru's ghost. You're stupid. I see Hikaru's ghost pretty often. You don't believe me, do you? That'll teach me to not believe you. Close the door in my face, idiot. Housekeeping! God damn it! It's always like when I have a setup, it's not that easy to touch the controller again. Make me move my arms. Oh, for fuck's sake, that's it, Drake. You go somewhere else. The bad drink. All right, this way. Go up there. This better be the last goddamn floor. Load it. Yep, it is. Okay. I think the guy lives over here. So we'll go over here. Aww. Holy crap, it's the fucking lead singer from Sum 41. Who the hell are you? You doing stuff like this with a face like that? <laughs> Fuck you, game! <laughs> You're breaking the fourth wall. Stop it. Huh? Have we met somewhere? Are you hitting on me? Maybe not. I know about the kid below dying. I'm not totally unrelated. But I have nothing to talk to you about. I heard some noise on this floor. But I was in a bad mood. Unfortunately, what happened right near me may as well have happened in another world. If you're done then, hurry up and fuck off. Your face pisses me off. Have we met before? Oh, Jesus Christ. Is that going to be a thing? Probably. It probably is an actual... There's nowhere else to go. I have no idea what I'm doing. What the fuck? I guess go back to the first floor? I don't hit them all again, do I? I'm going to try. Dude, I don't, I don't know what I'm doing. There's a seat. Okay, everyone's pissed at me. Cool. Jehovah's Witness! Who the fuck? Something else? Who the fuck opens the door for Jehovah's Witness? Really? Oh, yeah, down there. Go back! God damn! It's more confusing because I hit down like an asshole and then down does not go back because your mind tells you to because you're used to doing that every other game. 
fuck this, I'm just going to the first floor. Now that I pissed everybody off, thanks Japanese Slash, you jackass. Where is he? He should be here by now, right? Like, that's what I'm doing. I think I'm meeting him. Yeah, let's just go out here. Oh, Jesus Christ! Okay, that, that got me, because I didn't expect that at all. Plus, it's like dark. It's dark in the in the picture. That doesn't even make sense. Why is it dark? It's clearly daytime. I won't allow it. I won't let anyone bully Koichi. Oh, is this the ghost that they're seeing? Hey! Hey! I'm gonna go look to the... What the... Oh, Christ. Over here! What are you doing, you fucking idiot? <laughs> what are you doing over there? Hurry up and come here! Oh wow. Koichi! Koichi! Forgive me, Koichi! I'm sorry, Koichi! What the fuck? It's like dark here and nowhere else. Well, make sure before you leave. Yeah, I figured I couldn't leave. So make sure there's no... Yeah, there'd be a contact point, Brain. And I gotta go all the way back up there. You shitting me? Son of a bitch! Third floor, right? Yeah, third floor. I'm a... I kind of like that this game does. Most games don't do this anymore. The tension and the thought of, oh fuck, what's gonna happen when I get up there? It's not like I can pull my gun and do it. There's nothing I can do in this scenario. The fuck is going on? Ghost? God damn it! It's 302, isn't it? I'm on the wrong floor. I went too high. Did I really? I <laughs> went too high? Oh, okay, I didn't. Room 402. Really? It's randomly... Okay, I'm thinking... I'm thinking I should save. I don't really think there's anything difficult in this game, but I'm gonna save anyways. Because I'm kind of scared, alright? Shut the fuck up. I remembered something. Hikaru was really terrified. He was really scared of something. Especially that day. <laughs> it was scary. We went oh, I went to a haunted house with Hikaru. He got really scared. You took a guy with a weak heart to a fucking horror show. That sucks. That What a fucked up poor like memory for that kid. It was an old amusement park and all the ghosts were real veterans. It was really cold inside and it was super scary. It was almost like the real thing. Nobu is so cool. <laughs> you don't know what that means, do you? Huh? What? What's that? I wonder who that is. Who was it? Something doesn't feel right. The sun was bright and reflecting on the apartment building. I know. From the third third floor of the apartment building. He was watching. Watching Hikaru. Huh? Hicker, now let's get out of here. But my foot! Hurry up! Koichi, no! He's coming, he disappeared! Those two things don't go together, you idiot! Is he coming or did he disappear? Huh? On the stairs! Help! 
Run! I'm not gonna watch a kid have a heart attack, am I? <laughs> Don't do that! <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't feel so good. Please leave me alone for a while. Please? I want to be alone. Oh, for f yeah, okay. I thought that was still the story. I thought he was like, but I was like, that's not the kid that had the heart attack. I was very confused. Then I realized he's just about, he doesn't want to talk. He's closing off. I don't blame him. He'll never forget that day. That sucks, man. Let's me save. I'm gonna end the video here. You're being called into the break room. Ha ha ha! I never do anything. What? Who calls me into a break room? You call me into the fucking meeting room, not a break room. What the fuck? I'm gonna save. This is the weirdest ending ever. I don't. It's, it's almost a cliffhanger. But who calls somebody into a break room? So thank you guys for watching. I will see you on the next episode. Like I said, I could have skipped this episode entirely, but I didn't want to. Thank you for hanging out, having fun. I'm going to keep going. I want to learn the backstory and just keep going. And it's kind of neat to do this with the novels. And I just put Danganronpa on hold. I'm going to do that in the same fashion. That's going to be way harder than this because that's got face cam. But I don't care. I like the idea of a daily novel for people to come, hang out, and then hopefully maybe they'll check out other playlists and just chill out. But... Thank you, thank you so much for hanging out. Later.